<laughs> Speaking of men's responsibility, let's let's the get quality of these dudes at, at church. I don't know. Cause okay. I'm not because a bunch. Never mind. Yeah, never I'm not in the mix like that. I don't know the quality. I'm assuming it's great, but then I start listening to the ladies, and I'm like, dang, this. But I thought he was serious about Jesus. So it's because even the simple, even the 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 simplicity of like no sex before marriage is a thing. That's wild to me. That's like, I remember. It's like, yeah, I love God, but like, what you mean? I did two years of celibacy before I got married. It was like, no. But that was like the least common denominator. It was like, that's the bottom barrel for me. It was like, all right, we're going to chill on this. There was so many other characters. I was still toxic when I got married. I was a little we toxic. We all have, you, you know, know. But the Lord has still. to sanctify us all. But I'm, but that's even a thing that's with so with wild. with men who say they love the Lord. Yeah, that's It's like, wild. oh, I love God, but like, what? Okay. So, okay, <laughs> my brain is boggled. Church dudes, dudes who love Jesus, come on, man. I mean, at least common denominator. Now, listen, I'm not saying it's the stain of all stains to like, oh man, <laughs> like, because I think there is this idea of like, if you did that, you're unworthy. I don't want to paint that no, picture. No, not at all. But it's a covenantal practice. It, but it's like we just have to not. Yes. We just have to not. <laughs> but I told my so I told my daughter. I told my daughter and I told my son this too. But I said, I said, the Bible says your body's a temple. Mm -hmm. If your body's a temple, I just finished Leviticus. Only one person's allowed in that temple, the mm, priest. Boss. If it ain't the priest, it's gonna be problems. Problems. So it's one person supposed to be in the that's, temple. That's <clears> it. <throat> that's it. That's it. It's, it's, and you <laughs> really will save yourself from so much mm -hmm. foolishness. Wow. So back to back to the men. Um, she's basically saying she's running into Christian guys that are having problems with basic, basic stuff. Right. 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 Um, I moved this from last week because we had a very similar conversation already and I didn't realize it was back to back. We we're going to have oh, yeah. the same conversation. So what do you think about what she's saying? Megan Ashley, first of all, I'm, I'm, I'm very proud of her. She made a shift and it's been consistent, consistent, consistent commitment to her walk with christ since she um made that decision on her podcast she started talking about it publicly um and uh she is still thriving in it so she's doing a great job but what about the fellas what's what's going on in the church man from a single man perspective I, I've, I've talked to young ladies and they'll say well i don't know how you're going to feel about this um but i don't want to have sex till i get married is that okay with you i'm like i'm a christian <laughs> you know what I'm and they'll yeah. be like yeah but it's a lot of guys who are like man I got urges, I got desires, I ain't no virgin, I don't know if I can do this. I'm just like, wow, this is really like a regular, I just had the conversation literally yesterday. Yeah. And she wow. was, I said, this is like a real thing that God is saying? She was like, yeah. Mm -hmm. She said, it's not a lot of guys who are willing to wait until they get married. They're like, man, I gotta see if I'm compatible with you sexually. I gotta see if, you yeah. know, cause I don't wanna mm -hmm. get married and then we get in the bedroom and then it just ain't, it ain't, it ain't clicking. You know what I'm saying? They're giving them all these different kind of excuses. Wow. And I'm like, wow, we got some ministry pimps out here, bro. <laughs> <laughs> for real, for real. Ministry pimps? Wow. Facts. Yeah, bro. When I met, when I met, I met my wife, uh, we were young. We were 18, 19, and she was on that. Like, I'm not doing nothing. <laughs> and I was like, cool. Because I never met a female that said they weren't, you know, that mm -hmm. it wasn't going down. Now, the first few years was cool because I was on that too. But then when I started to like, you know, after a while, I was like, well, we ain't, we ain't got married. I'm like, man, <laughs> you know, so then I would go, I'm just being transparent. Mm -hmm. I would go find, you know, I find somebody else. Maybe we would have, we would break up or I would cheat on her or vice versa. Mm -hmm. And cause we were young, we were 18 when we met. So yeah, yeah, yeah. you talking about early twenties mm -hmm. and, and, but what kept her around for for like what had me going looking at her going, I gotta have her though. So I like say let's say we would break up or whatever. I meet somebody else. They down. Whatever happens. This was this was when within the first few years of us. Okay. I would still be like man, but like her. Mm -hmm. But it was because it was too easy everywhere else. And with her, it wasn't a challenge. It was. Mm -hmm. It was respect. It was like, Thanks. man, this girl ain't no joke. Like, this girl really stands. So I'm saying all that to say, we, man, we weak. We yeah. just weak. Like, yeah. as men, like, we we want 
and 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 a lot of times it's it's uh that's why like I thank God like this is to anybody dealing with with porn and issues and stuff. We've all been seeing through movies and through porn and through all of this stuff like fantasies of what mm -hmm. this stuff looks like, and we want to live that fantasy. Mm -hmm. So when you have a female telling you, "No, I'm not going to do it," it's like, well, fantasy's over with. I want to go. But then you realize it's, you're not gonna find that nowhere else. Yeah. We treat yeah. women like objects. We, we objectify like object. women. Yeah. It's yeah. Women, it's like. But that's what porn yeah. does, though. Yeah. That's what porn does. Yeah. It, it makes you object somebody, so that you think that's what they're that's what they're there yeah. for. And it's this mm -hmm. thing that yeah. we're missing. I think in men, we're missing inside of us. Now, me and James been talking a lot about fatherhood issues, right? I'm lately I've been real big on fatherhood issues, right? I think a lot of us didn't have the father, and I'm just speaking for me. Mm -hmm. I didn't have my father going, "Hey, you should respect, or you should do this, yeah. or do that," yeah, or having facts. a father going, showing me, "Hey, I love this one woman right here." Yeah, yeah. So this that's the way I should see things. Yeah. So when I grew when I grew up, I'm when I get a little older, I'm like, I'm looking at. All what the rapper said, <laughs> yeah. you know what I'm saying? Ain't no fun if the homies can't have none. That's yeah. what I'm growing up off of. Not a man telling me, "Boom!" Like this yeah. is the way you should treat this woman or and, one woman. And I think yeah, I think so. that's the thing, though. Like we grow up in these environments that show us not to be faithful to a woman. The music yeah. says that. Yeah. The the people, some people in our family are got you. You see them. You go to their house. One girl yeah. come in. One girl come yeah. out. It's yeah. like. We, we're not mm -hmm. trained to see that, but the word of God says, you know, Jesus says, you know, this is my bride. Yeah. I yeah. love just that one bride, you know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? And we got to be that model, you know what I mean? And I yeah. think, I think sometimes it's hard. I think it's hard because we, we, we're, we idolize, unfortunately we idolize lust. We idolize yeah. that fine looking woman. We idolize body parts. This yeah. is being real. Mm -hmm. And I think what we have to do is go, f we have to leave that and being like, God, that's an idol for me. Yeah. Help me with that idol because mm -hmm. this is an idol and I need to change because if I'm, if I, if you come across a godly woman, that you like, man, this woman is godly. She this, she that. She's what the scriptures are talking uh -huh. about. Why am I going to mess that up right. for my flesh? Uh -huh. right. Why am I going to cheat on her? Why am I, you know what I mean? Why am I going to do a round wrong? pick? Yeah, yeah, you got the, you got the, <laughs> God is you blessing you with something that <laughs> like he's that. like, I'm yeah. trusting you with something valuable. Yeah. If I keep it a bean for me, what really helped me is just having my little girl, my daughter. Um, mm -hmm. Like, because yeah. like I said, coming from coming from a, a street background, like you ain't gotta be from the street, but it's just a man in general in America. Like lust was just prevalent. Like yeah. I was a, a avid supporter of the strip club at one point <laughs> in my life, you know what I'm saying? Fornication, you name it, you know what I'm saying? Porn. And um just coming to Christ, just fighting that flesh, fighting those desires. And then when I have a child, I have a little girl now. I'm raising a little girl, she lived with me. And um I'm just looking like, man, this it's my daughter. Like I would do anything for her to keep her safe and protect her and yes. nourish her and make sure. Yes. Everything. And I'm looking like that's how God is looking at His women. So it's like if you feel that way about your daughter, how you think God feel about His? Yeah. So now, as a man of God, I have a responsibility to treat this woman the way a woman of God should want to be treated, even if she is a thought. You know what I'm saying? It's, <laughs> I'm not gonna treat her like that because. That's something she got to work out she with her and God. Yeah. You know right. what I'm saying? And I was a thought. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> I'm a reformed thought. You know what I'm saying? So if he did it for me, he could do it for them. Yeah. But I'm not going to contribute to the thoughtness by <laughs> by taking advantage of that. I'm going to say, yeah. you know what? You were made for more than that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? God made you for a purpose. You know I, just, I just want to say this, too. Um, I think a lot, a lot of our women are having to make so many compromises because of the lack of discipline of, yeah. of us. Yeah. yeah. Big facts. You should be a prize as well. You know yeah. what I mean? Like yeah. you should. You, they should feel proud that they found you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They shouldn't be like, "Well, I guess I got to work I'm with this dude." My wife that right now. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm about to text get, that to my wife right now. I guess I got to deal with say, this. What did you say, Sean? <laughs> what am I saying to my wife right now? We should I'm be a, a prize, prize too. too. I'm a prize but, too. Yeah. But in the sense of you should be making yourself into a prize, right? Like. The prize is a man of God who stands on his yeah. word, that does what he yeah. says, that really loves mm -hmm. Jesus, that doesn't need to be convinced to yeah. <laughs> to do things yeah. that the Bible already yeah. said. Like I, you should. I'm just challenging the guys to, to because it does take somebody to say it is possible. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It is possible for is. you to yeah. live 
mm-hmm. with you know not live with but have <laughs> have a because it's probably not possible to, to to have to Next have a, a a girlfriend fiance shockers. and make it all the way to marriage without having sex with that person it's yeah. possible it this is, is not yeah. like a pipe it dream is. right yeah. mm-hmm. so the point is is that it's expected of you so yeah. no more excuses no more well what about this what about yeah. that it is an expectation for you to lead your household from however long you meet her until you get married to make sure that you guys are pure. If you if you having trouble, speed it up. Yeah. <laughs> Figure out how to get married faster. Yeah, the court but that is the only that's the only dial you can spin. You cannot right. change the other one. Yeah. So yeah. you should be you should be making yourself an prize so that these women don't have to feel like right. I gotta I gotta choose from this this ragtag bunch of dudes Man. or I just gotta wait till somebody come and talk or to take, me. Or I gotta take somebody husband. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? So it's like it's like we we have happening. Has been, we wait, have this wait, 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 what? <laughs> <laughs> it's happening out there. It's happening. We, so we yeah. twenty we twenty to one in Atlanta. Something yeah, but like that's that. but that's the yeah. problem. Is so that, they so they'll go find something. I went to Clark Atlanta. Listen, twenty five to one. Yeah, yeah, they'll take they'll take someone that's that they look they look at a man that's you know that's yeah. married a piece yeah. of man. They look no at man a man at with no job, ain't got nothing going on for himself, yeah. or he might be on the low. Just be real. That's the one. The one is 20 to 1. The one is a man that's not married, got a job, he ain't gay, and yeah. may got a, you know, education maybe by the job. It's, there's there's a few factors that go to the one. Yeah. So now it's hard to find that one, so they start taking they start taking layers off. I, yeah. And it's like, but no, but we had a responsibility like what he's saying. We got the responsibility to be if you single. James the one. I'm sorry, brother. I ain't even gonna <laughs> like that. James the one. Yeah. So James James has a responsibility. I ain't gay. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Let that be known. Oh, that's James. the show. James, James the one. No, that's the show. James Are you playing one. James? Yeah. 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 James is one. So James as a man has a responsibility to be the one. So that means yeah. when James is being courted or courting, however you look at that, I don't know yeah, if I said that yeah, right yeah, or wrong. Yeah. No. When James is courting, James James now has on his responsibility list to not to not file the one because now they're going to be looking at all the other yeah, ones yeah. like that's exactly you listen, know what i'm bro. saying so i pray for you brother no you know what i'm saying it, and then we have a responsibility yeah. as us yeah as husbands mm-hmm. to be the one in our household yeah yeah you you so that it could be seen that it's possible yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. you 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 really have a huge responsibility and it's it shouldn't it shouldn't take a woman coming up to you saying, "Are you willing to do this? Are you willing yeah, to do that?" That's ridiculous. You shouldn't have, uh, young ladies. You shouldn't have to do that. <laughs> yeah. You shouldn't have to do that. The the man yeah. should be able to say no. Yeah. I, if if they're saying they're a Christian, right? Yeah. yeah. They should be able to say, "This is something I'm doing for me. Right. Yeah. yeah. I'm doing this. I'm doing yeah. You don't have to yeah. convince me yeah. to do it. Yeah. I'm doing this. Yeah. I'm not saying it's easy for me to do right, it. Right. But yeah. I've already decided to do it. Yeah. I, yeah. I don't want. I don't right. want these young ladies having to pick through trash to, to find a man. Yeah. Like you should be. You should be a prize. <clears throat> meaning, you should be who God says you're supposed and to be. Take by that practical time. steps, bro. Like just being real. Like it's summertime. You. We all got eyes, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, take, take practical steps, bro. Don't be going over her house late yeah. at night. It ain't too much to talk about late at night. Um, don't be going from places and, where, you know what I'm saying, it's just y'all all private. Yeah. You know you struggling, bro. You know, you got to have accountability. Yeah. Like, yeah. smoke yeah. come before the fire, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You already know which way yeah. it's going. You got common yeah. sense, yeah. you know what I'm saying? You know them scriptures. Yeah, yeah, yeah I, I think. Mean, covering my eyes not to look lustfully at a woman. When I was um, when I was single, I was, I was very... Um, determined to get my walk with christ right Mm -hmm. so that it did not fester into the relationship being toxic or the relationship Mm -hmm. being um you know me taking advantage of a woman because she was a woman it was more like no like if i mess up i mess up with my father Mm -hmm. i I don't want to do that so that was important but i'll tell you the funny thing about what me and my wife been doing lately we've been watching a lot of the um uh Pop the balloon or find love, yeah, oh, yeah. and we we Pop um man we yeah. we sit up there and we um define the train wreck before it happens. Yeah. Like yeah. we see the toxicity in yeah, these people, yeah, and we're like, that. listen, yeah, yeah. if she go, if she says yes to him, this is what it's gonna look yeah. like. And then yeah. we go back and we watch the little clip yeah. of the reunion, That's exactly what and like. the dude is yeah. like. The woman's like, yeah, he was lying about this and he was lying yeah. about this. It's like, why did you listen to him in the first place? Like, yeah. his whole presentation was off. So, yeah. I, feel, I feel, man, I, I grabbed my wife's hand the other day when we were watching and I was like, thank you so much yeah. for choosing me and not mm-hmm. letting me live this type of life. Cause this See, is I get crazy. the other way. I need to be more like you. That? Because I'll be watching, we be watching them shows too, like Blind, the Love, <laughs> Love is Blind, blind and all yeah. that. And I look at be like, yeah, you got one. 
<laughs> <laughs> you got the prize, didn't you? I ain't crazy like them. You got, but I need to be more like baby. I'm, All 